Okay, folks. Okay, folks, this morning I just want to talk about linear diffusers. We're in this custom home down here in southwest Florida. We're actually adding linear diffusers. These uh, wider ones are the returns. They just happen to be three-foot returns. Put one on each side. This particular room is vaulted, plus the, you have the morning eastern sun. This here is supply, three-foot supplies. We actually put blocks in these so we make sure we have no problem because a lot of times when you put sheetrock or wood in, they'll squeeze it in. Okay, so I just got the spacers in the one over here to the left, as you see. All right, here's what the grills look like. These are the return grills. I want you to notice these have a one-inch slot. You always return more air than you supply. Okay? This here is a custom-made return grill for this particular application in this room. Here is supply grill. These are one-way grills. You can actually look inside and you can move the grills and deflect the airflow. Let me show you. Okay, so we have two supplies and two returns. Just some parameters that you need to know. Let's walk in here a second. And here you have three supplies, and over here you have three more returns. This here is what we called the master bedroom downstairs. Some of the things that you need to know is we figure everything in a 0.1 static pressure on supply and 0.05 on return. So in a linear diffuser, you want to figure about 50 CFMs per foot. So each one of these have 150 CFMs. So that's 450 CFMs out of here. And at 0.1 static pressure, I have put 9 inch flex on these. When you actually go to put your supplies in, and let's say you have two supplies, you want to third up the can so you have an even amount of airflow coming out. Another thing on these cans, when you put these in, you just got to really make sure your dimensions and your size, everything really needs to be square and straight. You saw the blocks on the other one. We put blocks in every single one of these cans. So when the sheet rocker put everything up, it didn't squeeze my cans because we made these out of inch and a half duckboard. If you have any questions, just give us a call. Maybe I can help you out, refer you to where you can buy them, help you with the specs, how it all works. I'm going to show you a rough-in can in just a few minutes. Just call Jones Air Conditioning, 239-596-5855. Please share, please subscribe, and please comment. And if you have any questions, go to jonesairconditioning.com. Thank you.